Hi, everybody. Good day. I wanted to come on and do a comparison video using the Perbel CC Cream. The reason that I'm doing this is because in my recent video, I did not do a comparison from one side with Perbel to the other side without Perbel. And many of you have asked me if there is even a difference. Perbel is a CC cream and it spreads like a moisturizer. It's very heavy, but it spreads like a moisturizer. And once you have it on, it covers like a CC cream and then it adjusts to your skin tone. So let's get started. I'm gonna take my glasses off. It is an overcast day here in New Hampshire. It's a little gray. I have my background light on. So let's put the Perbel on one side of my face. I'm going to just take half a pea size of the Perbel about that much and I'm going to dot it halfway down on one side of my face. Let me rub this in. And I will be glancing over to my magnifying mirror to make sure that I have it correct. Typically, when I use this, I do go under my eyes with it, but I will go back and put more on. And it's because when you first apply it, it's very light. It's not supposed to be like a foundation, full coverage. It's a CC cream. I'm gonna put a little bit above my eye lid. And I did this yesterday when I put my makeup on and it is a really nice base for eyeshadow. You can even get some of the darkness in the side of the nose near the eye. I have a lot of darkness there. It's genetic. Okay, I'm going to glance into my mirror here. Okay, this half of my face is with Perbel. And this half of my face is my regular skin tone. I even went over my lips a little bit. So you can see how nice it looks. And then on this side is my regular face with nothing on it. The Perbel will show up in your pores a little bit as white, but as it adjusts to your skin tone, that fades away. Also, if you do not exfoliate your skin on your face, the dry areas will show up. So you want to gently exfoliate. Okay, so I'm going to get in close and show you around my nose. I have some very large pores around my nose. I have large pores right here that tend to get filled with sebum. And, you know, I try to get, I try to do what I need to do for my skin to eliminate that right here. You can see that the Perbel has filled in those pores. And you can also tell this is without Perbel, this is with Perbel. So I'm going to do my whole face now that you've seen what it looks like. So it will collect a little bit in your fine lines and wrinkles. So what I do 
is I wait a little bit. As my face warms up the CC cream, then I take my fingers and I just kind of go where my wrinkles are and gently, gently even out where the cream has collected. And you can even use a setting spray if you want to. So this is my video for all of you. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this answered some of your questions. It's, I had it on all day yesterday. I went to work. I had an appointment in the morning and I was really impressed. By the end of the day, I'm ready to take off all of my makeup. So that isn't even a consideration for me. I, you know, if a makeup lasts me 12 hours, I am perfectly content with that. And then I have days where I don't wear any makeup at all. But the smell is so nice. It's not sickening. It's like, it's like the smell of a baby, but just a tad bit stronger. It's really nice. Okay, my friends, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. Ask me any question that you would like, and I will try to answer it to the best of my ability. But if you're not subscribed to my channel, then I don't always see your comments. I really would appreciate it if you would subscribe so I can bring you more content, all kinds of content, even singing. So be well, be blessed, be beautiful because you are, because there is nobody else on the planet like you. And next week, about... Let's see, I gotta gather all my hair here. About this much of my hair is gonna get cut off. And then this is all gonna be layered. And I will show you the results. I love you guys. Take care. Until next time. Mwah.